Welcome or welcome back and I need help at C-square. In this example, we have a quadratic because we have a parabola, right? And the vertex is negative 5 and negative 1 and the graph passed through 5 and 19. We need to write the equation. Okay, so first of all, let's take a look to something that I put it here on the screen that will help us to get the least partial of the equation. If you notice, h and k are the vertex so in this case h is negative 5 and k is negative 1 so that means the equation will be f of x or y equal what a times x minus h x minus negative 5 square plus k plus negative 1 plus negative 1 we can simplify this equation and we have a times x minus I'm sorry x minus negative 5 here and that becomes x plus 5 here square minus 1 okay but you notice we have a one small issue here we need to find that a for that a we're gonna for finding that a we're gonna use this given point 5 and 19 which means when x is 5 y is 19 or the value of the function is 19 so i'm gonna put here 19 equals 5 times i'm sorry not 5 a because that's the guy we need to find out 5 plus 5 to the second power minus 1. So if you notice, this is an equation. A simple equation, 19 equals 5 plus 5 is 10, then square is 100, so we have 100a minus 1. Okay, so now we're going to add 1 on both sides, and we're going to get here 20 equals 100a, divide by 100, and a will be 1 over 5. So now we can really write the equation. Okay, the, the final equation will be f of x equals 1 over 5. Write that a x plus 5, yeah? x plus 5 squared, don't forget the square, minus 1. That's it for this problem. You can also see here the, the graph of this equation and you notice the vertex negative 5, negative 1 and it goes through 5 and 19. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-square for more help. Thank you.